Hello everyone and welcome back to another die cast review. Today we have Kyle Larson's 2020 Credit One Bank Camaro Z01 1 LE for the 2020 season. Now, of course, this die cast only ran, well not die cast, but this paint scheme only ran, what, a few times? Now, before the whole pandemic started, there was only four races, three or four, that was ran before everything was shut down or postponed. And Kyle Larson was in those races, of course, but then they switched to online, and then they had the iRacing events, and Kyle Larson said something he, you know, shouldn't have, and he got booted. He's gone. He's coming back, but he's gone for now. <laughs> I don't understand how you can say something like Kyle Larson said, and Chip Ganassi equipment, you know, you know, he says something like that, which is already, you know, decent equipment. He gets kicked out of NASCAR. Comes back to Hendrick Motorsports. What? what? How? He literally got, that was the best thing he's ever done in his career. Was mess up. I, I don't understand. I don't know. But anyway, the reason I got this diecast was because it was from circle b diecast and it was marked down it was like 30 dollars so i got it not because of the price not because of the driver not because of anything specific other than one certain thing and i'm sure you know what that is by now but i won talladega in the second season of the mcdonald's cup series of course I made the first one, which was in season one, and I'm going, I'm going to make the second one for season two. Right here. It's sitting right here. I just got to make it. So just like the Kyle Larson of 2019 <laughs> and just like the Kyle Larson of 2020, they're going to go hand in hand and go as customs for my personal use uh, for my league wins in NASCAR Heat 4 and 5. So. Yeah, I had to get the 2020 mold, of course, it's the new mold, it's got the Cup Series banner, and for whatever reason, Lionel is putting the short spoilers on the ones that are supposed to have tall spoilers. So like, for example, uh, the Alex Bowman came with a short spoiler when it was supposed to have a long spoiler, or a tall spoiler, and that was sad, you know, that was pretty sad, but this custom was going to be a Talladega race twin. That's a plate track. They got the big spoilers and splitters and stuff, right? I took a gamble. I'm like, you know what? This die cast is newer, or older, I guess, compared to now. They started putting out the, the tall spoilers, and then they did, you know, the short spoilers and the mix and match. But I'm like, well, this is where this is the beginning of the year. Maybe, maybe I'll get a tall spoiler. And I did. Luckily, I got a tall spoiler. I already had this out of the package. I took an Instagram picture, and that was it. I saw nothing else. It's still on the base. And fun fact, I don't have any. I don't have a screwdriver, so I'm just going to have to review it on the base, sadly. But, I mean, hey, you know, it is what it is. But, anyway, to the actual die cast. Kyle Larson, Lionel Racing, the official die cast of NASCAR. Standard finish, of course, nothing crazy. Uh, Credit One Bank, 2020. Got the render of the car right there. On the roof, on the roof, wow. On the top, you got Kyle Larson, 42, Cup Series, Chip Ganassi, 124 scale stock car, and you got Kyle Larson there. On the back, let's go ahead and take a look at this. You got Kyle Larson, 42, you know, nothing special. And then, of course, you got the 20 there, of course, for the, uh, whatchamacallit, for the year. And then on the front, it says you got the tag, Kyle Larson, Credit One Bank, 2020, Camaro Z01, one of 600. So there were 600 of these made. Of uh, the standard finish, at least, and I got one of them. I don't know what DIN number this is, but we'll have to take a look at that here in just a second. So I'm not going to do any editing. I don't feel like it. <laughs> I don't feel like cutting anything out, even though it's literally the click of a button. But this is just going to be a raw video, uh, other than, like, the intro and the outro, of course. But, boom. So in the box, you got the die cast. And something nobody really cares about, if I can get it out, 
It's just the Lionel Garage. It's nothing special, you know, nothing crazy. So I put the box down here and let's go a whoosh off. She goes with the plastic. Now, again, I don't have any screwdrivers. I, I it's, it's screwed in. There's nothing uh, not holding it down. There's definitely screws in there. So unfortunately, I'm going to have to get a very poor die cache review in. But I mean, that's all I got. And I've only got one light too. I don't have two anymore because one blew out. So yeah, two disadvantages. A big base and, you know, one light, which is fantastic. I'm so sorry. I, I wish I had a screwdriver. I just, I can't find any and I don't know where they are. But on the hood, or on the hood, Jesus, on the front here, got ZL1, got the 42 uh, Chip Ganassi, got the little mold here that's new to the ZL1 1LEs, and you got the smooth nose, of course. On the hood, you got Credit One Bank. We can go ahead and pop that open real fast so I don't forget, because normally I will forget. I don't know why, but I do. If I can get this open real quick. Oh, come on. I did it before. I did it earlier. There we go. Now, here's a 2021, or not 2021, but here's a 2020 engine detail. Uh, nothing crazy. I can't really get a good look in there. Uh, again, I have one light and it sucks. I can't really get a good job in there. But you can see there's a couple little different paints of there. Of there. In there, I guess. Got Credit One Bank on the hood. And you got Cup Series right there on the banner. Got the little camera, of course, you know, nothing crazy. Let's kind of scoot this back. Give me my light, please. Thank you. Got the 42, credit one blank, blank. Wow, I cannot speak today. Come on, Wrangler, speak up. Be a man, talk. Credit one, bank, or just credit one, really. Roof flaps do deploy, of course. You got Larson right here on the back. What's the DIN number? 544, so almost like right at the end of the makes, I guess, right at the end of the numbers. Uh, I think there was, what, was it 600? Uh, yep, 600. So 544 of 600. Nothing on the deck lid. Of course, you got the big spoiler, thank God. I'm glad we have that. That's good. I need that for the Talladega package looking, of course, because I ordered a different one for Christmas, and it probably has the short spoiler, and that's tough. <laughs> I hope it doesn't. But, I mean, if it does, it does. If not, if, if not, I'll keep it until I need it for something. But there's the back. You got Credit One Bank. You got the tail lights. You got the little, I guess that's a camera. No, it's like, no, it's a card. That's a Credit One card. You got the camera up there. There's a the camera. You got the ZL1 only in Camaro. That's a little low. You don't really see that error on 124 is that much. Got Credit One right there. Go look, look at the B post right here. Cessna Freightliner, Event Health, Clover, and Moss Energy. Wow, how about that? Got Kyle Larson there, got the American flag, got the 42, you got these stripes here and stuff, you got the little exhaust pipe and whatnot. Got Cup Series, 3M Lincoln Welders, Simons, what is, what are these? I can't tell that first one. Uh, Sherman Williams and Lincoln Welders. Then you got, let's see, a NASCAR race car there, of course. But I mean, yeah, I got Goodyear, and that's about it. That's not really much else to it. I showed you the interior, or not the interior, but the hood design the roof flaps and that stuff so nothing crazy but i mean yeah i wish they had the opening trunks on the arcs like they did back in 2017 but i mean you know it is what it is it happens i wish they just kept it but i mean i know i understand actually i don't because they don't put a lot of detail into these actually uh i'm telling you man if i was in lionel if i was ahead of lionel so much more detail would be put into this die cast i care about this hobby too much to not be ahead of something like that and not make a change. But yeah, that's it. There's nothing else to show. So with that being said, remember, this is going to be turned into a die cast, a custom die cast of my Talladega win. So look out for that. That should be pretty soon. As soon as I can find a screwdriver, I can tell you that much. But yeah, that's going to be it. Nothing else special, but I'm going to make this into a custom. So be on the lookout for that video. That will be... Uh, on the channel sometime i don't know it might be next year it might be this year i don't know for sure it's getting a lot colder and it is m being more difficult you know if you get cold weather uh ma making customs is not the best in cold weather you know i really want this to turn out pretty well like the first one so i don't know when i'll be able to get on this project but hopefully it is soon but anyway once again with that being said that is going to be all for this diecast review so thank you all so much for watching i hope you all enjoyed 
and I will see you in the next video.